fun and learning. Hello, young learners. I have a very special puzzle to share with you today. <gasps> but look, all the puzzle pieces seem to be missing. Hmm, I have an idea. Why don't you join me on an adventure to discover where the missing puzzle pieces could have gone? Yeah! It'll be a lot of fun and learning. Let's go. Oh, look, we have a gumball machine. Let's twist the handle and see what color gum comes out. It's a red gumball. Oh, wow. I see the red fish from our puzzle. All right, let's do it again. I see the color green. We have a green gumball. And look, it's the green fish from our puzzle. I wonder what color our next gumball will be. It's the color yellow. Hello, darling yellow fish. I know you can't wait to get back to your puzzle. Time to see which gumball we get next. Oh wow, it's the color pink. It's a beautiful color, don't you think? Let's get this pink fish back to the puzzle with the other fish. I'm so curious to see what color will drop next. Oh, it's a blue gumball. Blue is my favorite color. Hi there, blue fish. I know you'll be happy to get back to the puzzle. Twist, twist, twist. What's next on the list? Wow, young learners, I see the color light green. It's a very happy color. Here is our light green fish. Let's put it back on the puzzle board. We have so many colorful gumballs left. I guess the next gumball might be mm, white. I was wrong. It's purple. Off to the puzzle you go. I see a very adventurous gumball coming down. This is an orange gumball. And here is our orange fish. I'm putting it on the puzzle right away. We're almost done with our fish puzzle pieces. Let's see what we get next.
It's the light blue gumball. Beautiful, just like the sky. Wow, guys, it looks like we only have one missing fish. Let's see if we can get it from the gumball machine. Oh look, it's an aqua blue gumball. So pretty. You're going back to the puzzle, buddy. Look, a trash truck. Oh no, it's going to dump out all its trash. This isn't trash. These are the numbers from our puzzle. What's our first number? The number one. Hmm, where is the number one? Ah, here it is. The number one. What is our next number? It's the number two. We have one, two, Fish. Let's find the number two. Ah, oh, ah, oh, I found you the number two. What number comes after the number two? Correct, the number three. We have one, two, three fish. Time to find our number three. Oh, uh, here it is. The number three. This is the number four. Let's count the fish. One, two, three, four. And yes, I see the number four. It's right here. The number four. Can you tell me what's next after the number four? Great job, young learners. It's the number five. And how many fish do we have? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five. Amazing. Now let's find the missing number five. Aha! The number five. Oh, look here. I see a bunch of clownfish on this spot. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, Six. We have six clownfish. Time to find our next number, the number six. Hmm, I see it. The number six. Here you go. Do you know what this number is? Yes, it's the number seven. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven fish. And the number seven is where? Ah, I see it. The number seven. Looks like we are almost done with our numbers. Just a few left. 
Let's count the fish on this spot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight green fish. We need the number eight. Here it is. The number eight. Our next number is the number nine. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine fish. The number nine is right here. Wow, we are on our last number, which is the number 10. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten starfish. Time to find the number 10. The number 10. Do you know what this is? This is a minus sign. We use it to do subtraction. The minus sign is right here. This is the plus sign. We use it when we are adding two or more numbers. And this is our plus sign. Our next sign is the greater than sign. We use it to say one number is larger than another. And it looks like this. Our last sign is the equal sign. We use it to show that two numbers have the same value. Here it is. Oh look, we have sand. Uh, but wait, there's something hidden right there. Hmm, we need something to dig it out. But with what? This will do. Oh, wow, we have a blue egg. Sounds like there's something inside. Look, we have the star from our puzzle. The star is a five pointed shape. One, two, three, four, five. Let's put it on the puzzle. This is the heart-shaped piece. It kind of looks like a leaf. It is used to symbolize affection. Oh look, now I see something pink. Let's dig it out. Hmm, seems like this egg has something hidden inside of it too. Look at that. 
we have the circle puzzle piece. A circle is a round shape with no corners. Hmm, my little eye spice something green. Let's dig it out. I wonder what's inside. We have a trapezoid and a semicircle. A trapezoid is a four sided shape that has one pair of parallel sides. This is a semicircle. The semicircle is what happens when you cut a circle. Oh wow, do you see something purple sticky now? Let's find out what it is. It's a purple egg. It's not empty. It's time to open it up. Oh look, we have a rectangle. A rectangle is a four-sided shape that has two sets of parallel sides. Oh, just when I thought we were done, there's something else hidden right here in the sand. It is, let's see. A yellow egg. I think it has more puzzle pieces. Let's open it up. It has a triangle and a square. A triangle is a shape with three sides and three corners. A square is a shape with four equal sides. What's that noise? That's a vehicle transport truck. And look! It's carrying some of our puzzle pieces. Let's see what vehicles come off. Look at that. It's a cement truck. The cement truck carries cement to construction sites where it is used to build all sorts of things. The next vehicle I see is an aeroplane. An aeroplane flies high in the sky and takes people and goods all over the world. This is a fire truck. A fire truck carries firefighters and all their gear to fight fires. Let's put it on our puzzle. This blue and white car is a police car. The police drive this car to catch bad guys 
and help people. Do you know what this yellow vehicle is? That's right, it's a school bus. It's used to carry kids to and from school. This last vehicle is an ambulance. It is used for medical emergencies. Now off to the puzzle you go. We have almost completed our puzzle. <laughs> What's that smell? Oh no! We need a fire truck! Wow! The water from the fire truck created a rainbow! And look, they're the last pieces of our puzzle. Red. Orange. Yellow. Light green. Aqua blue. Light blue. Pink. and purple. Oh wow, young learners. You did an awesome job helping me find all the puzzle pieces. That sure was a fun and learning adventure. For more exciting videos, please like and subscribe. Bye bye.